All right, so we've got Jane Wu here from Shopo. Hi, thanks Hi. for having me. Um, <laughs> thanks for finding me <laughs> in the crowd. No, no worries. So, Shopo, online re reseller? reseller? Yep, yeah, retail. Yeah? Um, so you guys do mostly uh, women's, women's, girls' clothing, women's clothing, right? Yeah, that's right. So um, tell us about how, I guess, the idea came about. Um, it all started when, so basically I used to work in, um, I used to work corporate at Ernst & Young. And, you know, I spent most of my time just bored to hell. So I spent most of my time on Facebook or online shopping. Yep. And, you know, the online retail environment was really different back then. You really couldn't find anything. There, there wasn't that much that you could just afford on, like, a graduate salary. That you can have something new to wear for that Friday night, delivered for that Friday night, and something new to wear all the time. So I thought, this is like an obvious market gap. Yep. So that's kind of where um, it, it came from, yeah. So, I mean, you say there's a market gap, but at the same time, there's a lot of competition in the border oh, space, right? Yeah. So how is it that you've been able to kind of gain traction and I guess emerge out of the, you know, a very concentrated market? Yeah, um, I think timing was great. I think I did start quite a while ago, four years ago now. Um, and back then the market wasn't as competitive um, at this level. Yep. And we used social media to build up a following. Because I think even back then, a lot of the big companies, like even Maya and, you know, today, they don't actually believe or they either didn't believe back then in the power of social media, they thought maybe it was just a phase, mm. or they didn't understand how to use it properly, yep. which is something I like knew the ins and outs of Facebook back yeah. then because that's where I spent most of my days. Right. Like I was, it yeah. was my one hobby, just yeah. being on Facebook. So. At least some of us are willing to admit that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I guess, the, so the last question is, you know, you're, you've come on record to say you're not interested in taking venture capital, right? <laughs> but you guys are growing exponentially and you're doing yeah. very well. So what are your plans for for the future. What are your plans for the next 18 months? Um, just growth. Um, like Matt Barry, global domination. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. Perfect. So that's, we're good?